Today, the Justice Department is announcing charges in a significant national security cyber matter. The U.S. Attorney's Office for the Eastern District of Washington, the National Security Division have charged two Chinese hackers working with the Chinese Ministry of State Security, including the Guangdong State Security Department, GSSD, of the MSS with a sweeping global computer intrusion campaign. The indictment also highlights how the Chinese government is willing to turn a blind eye to prolific criminal hackers operating within its borders. Although the indictment alleges the defendants conducted activity on behalf of the MSS, some of the defendants' alleged criminal activities were conducted for their personal profit. China has now taken its place alongside Russia, Iran, and North Korea in that shameful club of nations that provide a safe haven for cyber criminals in exchange for those criminals being on call for the benefit of the state, here to feed the Chinese Communist Party's appetite for American and other non-Chinese companies' hard-earned intellectual property, including COVID-19 research. With the top cover provided by state officials, these criminals are given free reign to victimize law-abiding citizens around the world. All of these activities, state-sponsored theft of intellectual property, and knowingly providing a safe haven for cyber criminals run afoul of norms of acceptable behavior in cyberspace, which the international community must address.